Hey everyone, Shane here from the Spirit of the Cosmos. Thank you for joining me today for our Oracle card reading for the new moon in Aquarius. Coming Friday, January 24th. This new moon is very, very powerful. It is bringing a much needed change to what we seek along our golden path of spirituality. It is the first new moon of the year. It is the first new moon of 2020 and the decade. So it is very potent, very powerful. But before we begin anything, I have to say, it is freaking cold outside. It is so cold outside. I saw a politician with his hands in his own pockets. Woo! Corny jokes aside, I'm feeling the new moon energies days before I even before it even appears. But it's a beautiful new moon and I'm going to explain why. The new moon in Aquarius brings much needed energies and change to all of us along our golden path of spirituality. Aquarius is a sign of change. We are in the age of Aquarius. This is a new moon in Aquarius. And this new moon is heavily influenced by the planet Uranus. I don't like that planet's name, so I call it Uranus. Jokes aside, it is a very strange planet. If you study planetary sciences and you really research and watch Uranus over the many decades that we have been able to study it, it is a very chaotic planet. It is the bad kid in the class that doesn't listen, that doesn't pay attention. That planet is really influencing these new moon energies and with that is a good thing because you have a choice with this new moon do you stay with the old energies or move along with the new and for our beautiful oracle card reading that i'm about to do i'm going to use the energy oracle cards by sandra and taylor I love, love, love her work. I love all of her cards. They are very beautiful and positive, but straightforward also, and it's something we need with these new moon energies. So what is this new moon in Aquarius? It is a time for change, my friends. Over the past few weeks, have you been feeling incredible emotional ups and downs? Have you been feeling sad one day, happy the next, sleeping a lot one day? or can't sleep for days? Are you feeling any type of hopelessness or dread? These are the old energies that are clinging on too long and the new moon in Aquarius offers us relief from this, especially for you star seeds and light workers out there. The star seeds, have you been feeling a tremendous homesickness? Well, that's about to change. Light workers, have you been feeling a sense of powerlessness that's about to change. And we're going to do an oracle card reading to see what are three things we can learn. What are three messages from the higher realms that can aid us and guide us with these new moon energies. The new moon is a cycle renewance. It is the beginning of something new to break the old. Because the infinite creation that we live in, the universe, constantly expands and creates and grows never sticking with the old cycles that's what keeps it infinite so we're going to tap into that power we're going to really tap in and see what are three things we can learn with this new moon through the oracle cards so it is time my friends for this beautiful card reading i would like to pray first prayer is one of the most powerful forces any soul can ever use to help them along their golden path of spirituality. My friends, the universe is full of positive and loving energies ready to assist us if asked. And prayer is a beautiful way to show gratitude and thanks for receiving these energies. So I pray to the higher realms to give me three amazing messages, three things to think about that we as a spiritual community can use to aid us along our golden path of spirituality. Give us three beautiful messages, three things to think about for this new moon in Aquarius. And so it is. We'll shuffle now. 
Let's pick these cards or let them pick themselves, whatever works. One fell out, caught it. This one's sticking out. And what else we got? Hmm. This one on top. I like the off the top. Let's see what we have, my friends. Ooh. The first one that came was the Archangel Uriel. Anytime you draw a card as an oracle and a being or a soul or entity appears in the, in the cards, that is a powerful message from that source. I just prayed, I received that. Coincidence, my friends, does not exist. The second card was the Angel of Love. You can do anything with love, baby. Anything. Love is what makes all of us. Love is what binds all of us. You can do anything with love. And the Angel of Love, you rock. And we have, hmm, adjacent possibility. I've never drawn that car before, but I'm very familiar with it. Let's see what, it's, what it has in store for us. So I'm gonna reflect on these cards, meditate a little bit, and we'll get started with the reading. Our first card for this beautiful new moon in Aquarius oracle card reading is the seventh chakra, Archangel Uriel. Very straightforward. Anyone who knows me and has been watching my channel for a while, you know I love the angels. The angels, I'm gonna get emotional. <laughs> but the angels are the most amazing groups of souls that are willing to aid you in any way, shape, or form if you ask. I have proven this over and over and over in my life. It is very personal to me. Archangel Uriel with the seventh chakra is stating to you that with the new moon in Aquarius, it is a time for you to connect to the universe, connect to source, meditate, reflect, and really open the crown chakra so you can receive in these new energies, these new downloads, these new sets of information that you need to really shine as you walk along your golden path of spirituality. This Archangel is telling you that you are one with the universe. The entire universe is folded in within you. You are not separate from the universe. You are the universe. Everything around you is the universe. And because of this oneness, because of this unity, we are limitless. We can achieve anything. We can manifest anything. We can help others, whatever you need. And since the new moon in Aquarius is all about change, you really want to be connected to the universe. Really, really open your heart and crown chakra to the universe so that these new energies can come in to better aid you with whatever it is you seek. What newness that you seek in your life. Love the card. Beautiful message. Very straightforward. Thank you, angels. Ah, I don't know what to say. They're beautiful, they're amazing, and they always, always just help me out anytime I need. So, another message I'm getting from this card is, ask your angels for assistance. <clears throat> Excuse me. As you get rid of the old energies and make room for the new, ask your angels, help me, please, to follow the right path. Help me with whatever I need in order to achieve what it is I desire. And they always answer in the most miraculous ways. I could go on for hours about it, but I'm going to end it with that because we have other cards to read. But Archangel Uriel is telling you, open your crown chakra, connect to the universe. There's a lot of amazing things swirling about that you can bring in to help you along your golden path of spirituality. The next card for this beautiful oracle card reading is the Angel of Love card. This angel is holding a heart-shaped rose quartz. Notice the pink and roses and her hair and her aura is pink and the brilliant light shining down on her. My friends, the age of Aquarius, the new moon in Aquarius is all about newness and change. You can do anything with love. Love is the binding energies of the universe. Source, the infinite creator, God, the universe. However you see the creator of all things, it is love. 
Love can shield you from the most negative powers. Love can bring you connected connectedness with anything else in the cosmos. And the angel of love is letting you know that no matter what you pick along your golden path for this new moon, whether you stay with the old energies or pick the new ones and allow anything new to come to you, shine love onto it. If you take love and you wield it like a superpower, you will become a superhero and you can literally change everything in front of you. You can change your reality. Most powerful card in the entire deck is that one, the angel of love. Without love, we have no purpose. Without love, the universe cannot exist. Without love, there is no point to anything. Love is the ultimate power. That is a sign, along with Archangel Uriel, that we are really, really having a powerful new moon in Aquarius, where we can really manifest and change anything we want in our life, as long as we keep connected to the universe, have an open mind and heart, and allow love to be your superpower. Our third card for the new moon in Aquarius oracle card reading is adjacent possibilities my friends aquarius the age of aquarius the new moon in aquarius is all about change adjacent possibilities as you notice the many doors in this car the door at the floor the doors on the side and the golden brilliant door ahead this is telling you it's time for change coincidence does not happen my friends everything is in divine order hence this card reading adjacent possibilities there is something wonderful coming your way this is 2020 my friends 2020 baby it's a year for expansion and growth the world itself is awakening change is coming anyway and you have many possibilities which door will you take go with your intuition go with what feels right with you and don't forget our ally here archangel uriel telling you to stay connected and the angel of love ah love love rocks the angel of love telling you no matter what door you pick right before you open it shine love onto it because there is truly no right and wrong decisions in life everything is engineered and designed and fated for you to really escalate and move along your golden path even if it doesn't feel like it shine love onto it adjacent possibilities you have many options many choices coming your way shine love onto it use your intuition stay connected to the universe and allow the higher realms to help guide you allow your higher self to guide you if anything connect to your higher self because that is you connect to the oversoul the accumulation of all your lives the grand soul that you are the infinite creator that you are connect to that shine love and allow all of your possibilities to show themselves in front of you pick the one that you know is the right one for you walk through that door without any fear because you have love the angel of love is letting you know and love is the complete opposite of fear so love stomps on it this is a beautiful card reading. We have the new moon in Aquarius, all these changes coming, these new energies, and this, these cards are letting you know that it is time for you to make a choice. With these new energies behind you, with the angels behind you, you truly, truly can make the most amazing manifestations and desires appear before you if you allow yourself to love, trust, and connect to the universe around you because life loves to serve itself the universe has your back you hear this all the time because it is true wow <laughs> what an amazing reading thank you angels thank you uh, i can make a 12-hour video of me just saying thank you angels but thank you my friends for watching the spirit of the cosmos i'm quite emotional right now i'm feeling it this card reading has been very powerful for me i hope it did it for you as well i hope it gave you something to think about at least reinforcing 
the fact that these new energies are coming we're feeling it we're going to take our realities and really shine love and connectedness to them so that all of us have a more positive outcome give me a like leave me a comment down below what are you doing for the new moon what is your goal for the new moon and let me know how this card reading resonated with you thank you so much for watching the spirit of the cosmos i love each and every one of you remember the most beautiful thing no matter what remember how unique and beautiful you are there is no one like you in the entire universe you are your own soul song you are your own unique vibration of infinite uniqueness and no one can ever take that away from you no one can ever replicate or duplicate that you are unique baby you gotta love it thank you again for watching i'll see you in the next video goodbye for now and you rock remember that baby